Today in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, I'm hanging out with Sports Illustrated swimsuit model Paige Sporanic, who just happens to have a big voice in the world of golf. I'm Charlie Reimer, and this is Riding with Reimer. Hey, Paige, hey. how you doing? Good to see you. Good. Great, let me grab this bag. Uh, thank from you. Here. Well, we got a good day ahead at Grand Dunes. Let me get you loaded up. <laughs> oh, 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 what do we got here? This is my dog, Nico. Actually looks just like him. Oh, Nico, And I see beautiful. you have one, too. Yeah, that's my dog, Buzz, right there. Aww. Golden Retriever. <laughs> love them. Absolutely love them. All right, hop on. We got a really cool golf course today. We're uh, going to take on Grand Dunes. Let's see what we got out there. I'm really excited. I know you played golf at, at San Diego State, but you participated in student government there. How, yeah. how did you decide to, to get into student government? So I was a part of the Student Athlete Advisory Committee. I like to help other people, and yeah. um, it's just a role that I've always felt really good in. You think maybe the fact that you worked so hard and had so much discipline in gymnastics when you were really young sort of led to you having that kind of spirit that you have now? Yeah, so I started homeschooling in fourth grade because I was training, gosh, seven to eight hours a day, six mm. days a week, um, when I was like 10 years old. So wow. it was a full-time job. Like when I watch gymnastics and, and I watch the balance beam, that balance beam is four inches, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I've had big putts before, <laughs> you know, like a three-footer, if I miss it, it's mm -hmm. gonna be painful. With that balance beam, you mess up, you're gonna hurt yourself. I mean, that, that's yeah. scary. It was tough, like it was definitely really hard. And when I was, gosh, how old was I? 12, um, I ended up fracturing my kneecap twice and mm. had a couple other really bad injuries and I, I started to really hate gymnastics and mm. it was really, really tough and so that's when I decided to quit. It's different though, I feel like golf is more intense mentally than any other sport I've ever done mm. and I would much rather do a double back off of a four inch balance beam than have a four footer to win a tournament. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's long and right down the middle, <laughs> but very boring. This hole goes that way. You know what I've always wanted to do here? What? Is launch one right down. Are you allowed to do that? The intercoastal. No, but watch this ball, how pretty it is flying down through there. Boom. Smoked. You know, Paige, some people don't go that far on vacation. <laughs> I'm still in the water. golf guys or people in golf are like the funniest kind of like crazy guys why do you think golf is so like serious and conservative then when they are literally like just so goofy <laughs> and crazy I, I don't know it's, it's almost like the fun part of golf is you could be walking down the fairway telling your caddy a dirty joke without smiling and the people over there thinking like, oh, he's so they're serious. talking about the grain or yeah. something and no it's like some nasty joke why do you think they don't want to showcase that more and make golf fun and relatable? I think that's a good question. I think a lot of it comes down to the tour just being buttoned down. And if you look at a lot of the sponsorships, uh, really conservative corporate sponsors, it was a big deal to get uh, uh, tour players to be able to wear shorts and practice rounds. Yeah. You know, I was like, oh, they're wearing shorts and practice rounds. Well, yeah. you know what? They're wearing shorts and practice rounds and the world's still turning. Yeah. So, um, I, but I think that happens a lot. You know, a lot of these clubs, they get these old archaic rules and uh, the younger people, as they come along, they're just not gonna put up with it. Yeah. You know, if I go play golf, I'm gonna listen to music. And <laughs> if, you can't, if you can't let me do that at your club, I'm not gonna join there. What do you listen to? You know, uh, golf both kinds of music, country and Western. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you ever listen to Blake Shelton? Yeah. Yeah, I've seen him a couple times in a concert this year. I don't know him. That's not a lookalike. Yeah, oh, yeah, all right. Yeah, he <laughs> was the sexiest it. man in the world. <laughs> listen to a lot of Hootie and the Blowfish. Yeah. I love those guys. And, I like Monday After the Masters is always so much fun to uh, go to. It's a blast. Let's, let's change gears a little bit. Uh, you've been in the forefront in fashion in a lot of different <laughs> ways, including modeling uh, for Sports Illustrated mm -hmm. swimsuit edition. 
What do you think about this hat that I'm wearing? You know, I feel like fashion is supposed to be fun, and yeah. I hate when people say, like, you can only wear this because it's fashionable. If you feel confident in what you're wearing, and yeah. you feel like you're rocking it, then do it. Wear, wear it. it. Yeah. Wear it <laughs> like, I'll, who I'll cares? Like <laughs> Take your hat off. You gotta try this. I'm long. not taking my hat off. You know, uh, size eight. <laughs> <laughs> Do I look perfect. good? <laughs> yeah, perfect. It's like two months to get that in. I got a giant, a giant melon. So, Paige, what's the best part of your game? A uh, short game, for sure. I can get up and down from anywhere, and I'm a good scrambler because I don't hit a lot of fairways. And I don't hit a lot of greens. Listen, I appreciate you coming uh -oh. out. And Thanks for having me. I had a great time. I'm right there with you. Roll it in. Paige is uh, really cool getting to know you a lot better and uh, also watching that short game that you got. I mean, that's really <laughs> impressive. Thank you. Thanks for having me. I had a really great time today. Yeah, always a lot of fun. And uh, thanks for riding with Reimer right here in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, the golf capital of the world. <laughs> Book your next vacation or get a customized quote at MyrtleBeachGolfTrips.com. Hey Paige, how you doing? Let me grab that bag oh, for you. Thank you. you. I'm gonna get a hug first though. Uh, wait, that's right. <laughs> I would like to say that the first time I ever met you, and within maybe seconds, you're like, hey, I'm Charlie. Do you want to hear a dirty joke? That was how we met. You know how to sell a chicken? To a deaf man? No. What about a chicken? <laughs>